Laugh Records presents the very fabulous Leroy Skillet and Luanda. <laughs> Yeah, who is? Yeah, yeah, that's my nephew right there. Your nephew? My nephew right there on that picture. Look at that. What you mean, this is your nephew? That's my nephew right there, boy. Your nephew on this picture? Famous man, too, buddy. Yeah? A black pastor. That's what he is. Black pastor. You dad go right. You yeah. know what he did, Leroy? What did that, Skillet? They put him in the sing, sing. Sing, sing. He escaped and got away. Got away. Got away, buddy. Give Your nephew. You're damn right. That's well, my help, nephew. Hell of a nephew. You got you that. You know what he did, Leroy? What is that? They put him in San Quentin. San Quentin. He escaped. Got away. Got away. <laughs> Famous man, partner. This your nephew right here. Yeah, you're right there. Nice looking boy, too, right yeah. there on the picture. This here is your nephew. Yeah, that's his picture right there in your hand. Yeah? You leg on right, that's his picture. I don't see your nephew on this picture, man. <laughs> you don't see him on that? No, your nephew ain't on that picture. Let me see. You look at it. Your nephew ain't on that picture. Well, up and down. That's so much got away again. <laughs> I'm Slack Jawed Leroy from 42nd Street. I hear you. I got money in my pocket and a big hunk of meat. I like the men folk. I'm the one, the big bottom. If you looking for thrills, motherfucker, I got them. <laughs> Harlem's my playground, just like a boy's camp. I dug you, baby, when you was leaning against that lamp. I checked you out, daddy, when you was shuffling up the road. I knew right then I was more woman than you could afford. You a fine looking chick. I think I'll take a chance. That's a whole lot of ass packed in those pants. Just look at you fool juicing at the lips. If you knew what I had, baby, you turned back over flip. <laughs> Mama, you are looking good. Soft, round, and nice. To know something that cool must have a big price. Now I see how you talk. Man, you a real dope. If you want to live high on a hog, baby, you got to ask the price of pork. Oh. <laughs> wow. Those big tits is enough to knock a man down. With nipples like grapes in my favorite shade of brown. Now, don't be bashful, baby. I'll speak first. You can buy me a beer to help quench my thirst. I'll buy you a beer to help break the ice. Get your ass drunk and probably cut rate your price. Now, if you like what you see and you like to pull it, baby, just reach in your pocket and pull out your damn wallet. You can bet your sweet ass I like what I see, but before I touch it, please state your fee. I like the way you talk. I know you a man of means, and it's going to cost you 20 to get in my jeans. Wow, 20 bucks, you say? That's a whole lot of cash. But I got to admit, honey, that's a whole lot of ass. <laughs> you better know it. It's the best in this city. Come on, baby, slip your hand in my sweater and grab hold that titty. <laughs> Shit. You ain't just a woofing. I like what I feel. 40 pounds of tits and every ounce is real. And that's just a sample, baby, of what you got in store. Cross my palm with green and I'll give you some more. Oh, yeah. 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 Ow. Yeah. Baby, you just made a deal. And here's your 20 bucks. Now let's find a motel so I can see how you fuck. Yeah. Hey, baby, I know a place just down there two streets. Baby, they don't ask you no questions and give you clean sheets. <laughs> well, in that case, I'll pay for the room. You go on in ahead and spread that fine ass all over the bed. <laughs> oh, honey, you are funny looking shit. But I really don't care, because I ain't gonna see you with your head down there. <laughs> well, here I come, mama. I see that you are ready. Cut out that puffing and blowing and hold yourself steady. <laughs> now, you can't really blame me for getting so hot. Get off them clothes, motherfucker. Let me see what you got. Yeah, it is, honey. Oh, look at that, look at that. Look at that. It made you blink. Grab 
hold of it, baby, and say what you think. Hot damn, what a jock. It's the world's biggest dick. Fifteen inches long and eight inches thick. <laughs> Stop all that smoking. I ain't one who begs. Lay back, raise your ass, and spread open those legs. Ouch! Ooh, who shit that hat? Get out the goose grease. And smear some on my hole before you try to fuck me with that big black pole. We ain't got no grease. And we are fresh out of law. So just do your duty and help me get it hard. Damn, you mean it gets bigger than what it is now? Motherfucker, I'll give you a refund. You go fuck a cow. <laughs> I fucked a cow last week. And before that, a horse. And now I want a woman. And that's you, of course. Well, I'll give it a try. You can't ask for more. But you take it easy with that damn two by four. <laughs> Fear not, Lawanda, big bottom. I'll show you I got class. I'll handle with care your beautiful big ass. Then let's get it on. I'm open real wide. Act like you the Lone Ranger, baby, and take silver for a ride. <laughs> You got it, mama. Take a deep breath. The last horse I had, I fucked Nelly to death. Huh? Huh? Fuck me good, baby. You better than any man before. Don't get me wrong, I'll take a little more. What you mean, more? You got it all now. If I didn't know better, I swear your ass was a cow. Now watch your mouth, nigga. Don't hand me no shit. No cow in the world can match me tit for tit. Wait, baby, uh, don't be so mean. I mean, you got the biggest pussy I've ever seen. Oh. Honey, if you stop bullshitting and get on with your fucking, I'll show you how my pussy can do some dick sucking. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Now I feel it. You got a talented box. Work it out, LaWanda. Work on that jock. You got it, Big Daddy. How's that for contraction? I told you I'd give you a good night of action. Shit. Your word is the truth. Pure action then some. Grab hold of your ass, because I'm going to come. <laughs> Then I can come, too. We'll do it together. Oh, goddamn, you a trooper. The one and the whore. Let's have a contest and see who comes more. Baby, you ain't got a chance, you big dick stud. Hell, I'll empty your balls all but the blood. Well, you'd better start swimming. My dam's gonna burst. I done got a head start. Hell, I'm coming first. The hell you will, Leroy. I already done started. Babe, I thought you knew it the minute I fought it. <laughs> Gee whiz, Leroy, you flat in the moat. I feel your juice clear up to my throat. You know I can't stop. I got no floodgate. I guess we are doomed. We done seal our fate. I suppose you right. It ain't too surprising. Hell, I can't see the flow and the cum is still rising. <laughs> well, I really hate to die, but I guess we both know to drown in love juice is the only way to go. Hi, Daddy. I'm coming, baby. Fuck me. I am. Get you take it, honey. Ow. Ow. Ow, goddamn. Ow, baby. Ow, Sex was having an insect ball. Now the music was a furnished by a cricket band. All the insects was right on hand. The bad boy, he had a special invite. 
he couldn't go, he had to wipe that night. While the flea rolled up on a big bull pup, and you oughta heard the bad when this drag goes. Oh! are loose and some are tight. But I discovered an idea how to set things right. When you get a girl and she's too tight, easy does it is the name of the game. If you force it in, she could wind up lame. Get a jar of Vaseline or any substitute grease. Loop the organs well and she should proceed with ease. If not, take heart. The battle just begun. Crawl in between her legs and sop her with your tongue. <laughs> Not only does it feel good and help her unwind, if you do it long enough, she's sure to blow her mind. Her juice will flow freely if you're a good muff diver, and the hole will lava quickly as it mixes with your saliva. By now she's ready, snorting and rowing. The little lady is anxious to do some real hoeing. So lift up her legs and spread the lips wide. Before you know it, you'll bury it deep inside. But don't be rambocious. It's still up to you to ensure your mate of a pleasure is true. Start with short strokes. Go from side to side. Keep a nice even temper and she'll enjoy the ride. Then pick up the action. Strike for the bottom. She'll wiggle and scream and you know you got them. She'll thrust it up to you with wild disasperation. Her box sloshy loosely with calm and perspiration. Then you get your gun, and she swoons with delight, and you will rest easily knowing never again will it be too goddamn tight. You right, Leroy. You right all the way. You should have seen me with Clap Trap Johnson the other day. Clap Trap Johnson, a pile-driving fool. Blacker than a tar pit, honey, and hung like a bull. <laughs> Honey, the first time I seen him was one hot summer day. His tongue was hanging out. That son bitch looking my way. <laughs> Child, he sure wasn't much. He looked like a bum. His shirt was all wrinkled and his pants stained with cum. <laughs> but business was bad, so I give the son bitch a glance. Hell, as long as I could do a shit, I'd take the chance. <laughs> Honey, Clap Trap got the hint. And he sure looked like death, and I damn near fainted from the booze on the son bitch's breath. Honey, he's just old wine old with a small welfare check and grease on his face from eating chicken necks. Yeah. Ain't that a bitch? So I quoted my price, honey, and old clap trap agreed, and we headed for my place, child, with all possible speed. Mm -hmm. Honey, I sent the son bitch to the shower. He bitch, but he went. Then I shook out my panties just to get a motherfucker to scent. Then I spread on the bed, honey, and hid my money right quick. A girl can't afford getting robbed by a trick. Then child, I slipped out my razor in case the son bitch got rough. Honey, in case of emergency, a hoe gotta be tough. And honey, I looked up and saw that son bitch standing there. Looking like a gorilla child, all covered with hair. <laughs> From the size of his dick, I knew I'd have fun. Oh. Clap Trap was a loser except for that dick. Three feet in length, honey, and at least a foot thick. That somebody had some dick, baby. <laughs> honey, with a head on his dick big enough to kill him. And balls 
like grapefruits, child. Red is ripe watermelons. <laughs> so I fingered my pussy that started to juicing. <laughs> Hell, to take all that dick, I sure have to loosen. <laughs> then I pulled open my split, honey, a god-awful hole, and he came a-running with that big totem pole. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, he grabbed both my cheeks and pulled them apart. And as he pushed in the head, I ripped off a fart. Yeah. <laughs> Two strokes later, that bastard hit bottom. And I started to shiver. That motherfucker knew I got him. Yeah. Hot damn, what a man. Hornier than a young buck. But I matched every stroke, and man, did we fuck. Oh, yeah, you're right. The hours passed by, but it didn't matter. Hell, he flooded me twice with hot baby batter. <laughs> and the zombies never once stopped, not even to breathe. Just kept that hot saber packed in my sheet. God knows how he did it, and I really don't care. Just as long as he kept that dick hanging there. <laughs> I knew I'd be so when the scene was over, but when we were fucking, honey, my ass was in clover. <laughs> he was groaning and groaning, honey. He was coming again and I opened it wide and he stuck it all in. The juice filled my gut. My hole was overflowing and for the first time, Clap Trap was finally slowing. <laughs> Honey, he let out a belch and rolled over on his back, and a cold gush of hair rushed into my crack. <laughs> honey, he walked to the bed, child, and dropped me a tin, but honey, I couldn't take it. He was the best of all men. <laughs> Instead, I said, Clap Trap, you a real man of plenty, a horse dream come true, and I gave the son of a bitch a 20. <laughs> With a real round of applause, Skillet, Leroy, and the Queen of Comedy, Luanda. <laughs> oh I would like to recite for you the Republicans' 23rd song. Nixon is my shepherd. I'm in want. He maketh me to lie down on park benches. <laughs> He leadeth me beside still factories. He restores my doubts in the Republicans' party. He guides me to the path of unemployment for his party's sake. Yet though I walk through the valleys of soup kitchens, I'm still hungry. I do feel evil, for thou against me. Thou nunnest my income with taxes. Yeah. So my expenses runneth over my income. Yeah. Yeah. Surely poverty and hard living shall follow me all the days of Republicans administration. Yeah. And I shall live in rent houses forever. Yeah. 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 5,000 years ago, Moses said, pick up your shovel, uh -huh. mount your ass, yeah. and I shall lead you to the promised land. Yeah. 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 5,000 years later, Franklin D. Roosevelt said, lay down your shovel, yeah. light up a candle, yeah. and set on your ass. Yeah. Hey. As this is the promised land. Hey. But now with Nixon, he will take your shovel, sell your candle, kick your ass, and tell you there is no promised land. <laughs> When the good Lord invented man, all the parts of the body argued over who should be the boss. Uh -huh. The brain explained, since the brain controlled all the parts of the body, that the brain should be the boss. Right. The eye says, man would be lost without me, so I should be the boss. Yeah. The stomach said, I digest all the man's food, so I should be the boss. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. 
The leg said, I take that summit everywhere you want to go. <laughs> so I should be the boss. Right then, the asshole applied for the job. <laughs> All the parts of the body laughed. They, felt, they laughed and bust out laughing. The asshole being the boss. The asshole got mad. Close up. <laughs> After two days, the eyes cross. The brain got foggy. The stomach got sick. And the legs got wobbly. That just goes to prove you don't have to be a brain to be the boss. All you need to be is an asshole. Bum stuff, Bert, you a useless old jerk. A lazy old fart and you never did work. Ass wise, Faye, you my lovely wife. But you complain all day about your rough life. Bert, you bastard, you done me wrong. Shut your face. Don't give me no shit. Clean up this place before I rip off a tip. Now you sit up there beaming all shrouded in glory and use my ass for remaining and leave me all gory. That's what you're for. That's why I got you. You my own private hole with a super-sized snatcher. Uh, into this crap, I got a surprise for you, cause baby, I got the clap and I gave it to you. Oh. What did you say? That sure is a shock. Especially to your mother, she just sucked my job. <laughs> oh God, what a mess. You clapped my mother? Hell now, nah, I must confess, I got it from your damn brother. <laughs> That's a hell of a fix you got this family in. Your mother such dicks. And you fuck my kin. Ooh. Bitch, where's my penicillin? I need a shot. I done caught the wrong thing from your fat funky cock. Yeah. Yay, though I walk through the valley of death, I shall fear no evil. For I'm the meanest son of a bitch in the valley. A lot of guys pass up women sometimes because they're too fat. A lot of guys switch over because he want that streamlined woman. But if you get you a great big fat woman, the ass is already there. Right. You ain't got to hustle up and say, pass me that pillow and let me jack your ass up. Oh, look like I rung a bell that time. The way you laugh, I can tell your ass been jacked up, baby. Get you a heavy hip woman, and that explain everything to life. When great clouds appear, and your sex life is a jumble, go find a fat girl and give her a tumble. Don't turn your heads. Please hear me out. Don't pass her off because she's so stout. Tits like balloons and cheats to match. Beneath all that fat lies a beautiful snatch. Yeah. Fat girls have feelings and itches like the rest, equipped with extra padding, and their off time is the best. Yeah. More bounce to the house. You remember the saying? Take it from me, they make the best land. Tits like balloons, as cheats to match. Beneath all that fat lies a beautiful snatch. Right. But don't be a brute. Treat her with class. Handle with care that overstuffed ass. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. The best way I've found, because they are so tight, is to go in dog fashion and please do it right. Tits like balloons, as cheats to match. Beneath all that fat lies a beautiful snatch. To ensure your interest with reasonable ease, Vaseline works fine, and so does bear grease. Yeah. Big girls appreciate a size of a log. When they get it in, God damn it, they snow like a hog. Don't cry, 
baby. Don't try, oh, honey. Don't leave me, please. Don't, don't try, oh, baby. Daddy ain't gonna be gone that long. I love honey. you, Daddy. I realize you love me, baby. Don't go, please. But I have to go, honey. But you, my husband. Now, honey, look, it ain't no work here for me in this city. Do you understand that, darling? I don't want you to work. But, baby, I mean, how, how can we make it if I don't work, darling? I don't want to make it. But everything is behind, honey. I don't care. Everything we possess is behind, honey. I don't care. The light bill's behind. <laughs> The rent's behind. <laughs> the, 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 the gas bill's behind. <laughs> yeah, well, sometimes I'm behind. You know that, darling. <laughs> please don't drive, darling. Don't leave me, please. But, honey, it's no work for me in this city. Do you understand that, I honey? told you I didn't want you to work. Well, I ain't going to be gone that long, darling. Do you understand yeah, that, Yeah, but you be gone too long. Look, look, baby. The man sent me a telegraph just the other day. Yeah. And on the graph... Uh, explain it to me that they want a freeway and wants that freeway to run from Harlem, twist, make a wiggle, and drop right in the middle of Vicksburg, Mississippi. Oh, no, Daddy! What's wrong? What's wrong? I honey? can't let you go to Mississippi. Ain't nothing gonna happen to me in Mississippi, honey. Oh, baby, now I won't never see you no more. I'm not going down there to stay, darling. But, baby, they'll hang you. I'm not gonna even hang around while I'm down there, darling. You understand? <laughs> baby, they'll hang you. Ain't nobody gonna bother me in Mississippi. I know my way around down there. If anybody get at me down there wrong, I can run. Do you understand? But look how fast you done got. You can't run as fast as you used to. Don't, don't let this weight fool you, honey. I know I'm having a seat, but I'm damn light on the feet. I'm scared for you to go. Don't be scared, darling. Look, Baby. we ain't making nothing, honey. See, the main thing about it, your dad is now getting in position to make money. Do you understand that? Money? Look at that. That word money. That's a pound of damn wood. Real money? The minute I said a word, money, your whole expression changed. <laughs> your daddy getting ready to make some money. You ain't got to dress like this here no damn more, baby. I don't. Hell no, I'm going to dress you from now on, darling. You're going to be looking good. Yeah. <laughs> That's right, darling. Everything I buy from you from now on, it's going to come from some of the biggest department stores I can find. Oh, big department store, daddy. Yeah, everything I get for you, honey, is I'm going to get it at Mr. Will's place, darling. Mr. Will? Yeah, I'm buying all your clothes Ooh, from Mr. Will. <laughs> Mr. Will? Daddy, who is Mr. Will? A Goodwill, damn it. Goodwill. <laughs> See, Goodwill, <laughs> they ain't got nothing on Salvation Army. You understand that, baby? Yes, baby. I'm going to dress you, darling. I ain't lying. dress me up. That's right, darling. <laughs> and daddy ain't going to be gone that long. Yeah, baby. Yeah, but daddy, how much money you going to make? How much I'm going to make? Yeah. Oh, baby. <laughs> daddy going to make so much money, honey. I'm going to make so much money, uh, I'm going to put in a croaker sack and ship it to you by freight, honey. A uh, croaker sack? That's right, darling. <laughs> you sure that ain't cotton? Hell no. It's going to be already cashed in when you get it, honey. <laughs> All right, Daddy. You can cash money from your daddy, yeah, baby. All right, Daddy. All I want you to do is be a good wife while I'm gone, yeah, baby. Oh, Daddy, I'll be good. All right, darling. Yeah, All right. Be good for Daddy, yeah, baby. Okay, Daddy. <laughs> I'll get you whatever you want, yeah, baby. Okay, Daddy. All right, Daddy. Take care of yourself. I will, darling. Goodbye, dear. And, and I don't want nobody here while I'm gone, yeah, honey. Oh, I won't be nobody here, dear. No, nobody at all, darling. Okay, dear. Nobody. Nobody. The milkman come. Just, just tell him milk is already in the house, yeah, honey. Yeah, well, what about the ice man? I don't even want the ice man here. Well, hell, I got to have ice to keep me cool. Look, honey, uh, I cool you when I come back. You understand that, baby? I don't want no ice man in my damn house, and I mean that. Nobody come here while I'm gone. Well, what about the paper boy? Uh, look, uh, the paper boy. You talking about little Junior? Yes, Daddy. The one been banging the paper for the last past yeah, five or six him. years? Yeah, that's him. That's him. Is that the one you're talking about? That's him. Well, cut the paper out. <laughs> <laughs> Junior, 17 years old now, woman. You understand that? <laughs> Junior's conversation strong as mine. <laughs> and another thing, Junior talked that old hustling talk. I was going to tell his daddy, but I found out his daddy was a damn hustler. <laughs> I want nobody here while I'm going, woman. I ain't lying. All right, I'm daddy. You. Right, just be good while I'm going. Yeah, baby? I'll be good. Goodbye, dear. All right, baby. Bye, daddy. That old motherfucker. Right on, oh. <laughs> that son of a bitch all dropped dead. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I want that bastard no damn how. Uh -huh. Honey, I got a man put him to shame, baby. I got a back no day. Oh, yeah. Woo! That's right, he beat you. Baby, yeah. your back no daddy is here. Oh, <laughs> run into me and wreck my life. All right, baby. <laughs> <laughs> hey, dad. Hey. Guess what? What is it, dear? My old man is gone. Where are you going? He gone to Mississippi, honey. Well, he'll never make it back. You hear what I said? <laughs> What are you going to do down there, sweetheart? Maybe he's going to build a freeway. That's what he's going to need, a damn freeway to get out of there. <laughs> and you know what he said, what baby? He, what he say? He said he's going to make so much money, uh -huh. they're going to have to put it in a croaker sack 
is ship it to me, air free. And here I am laying here to get it. <laughs> Go ahead, <laughs> Take that talk to you, please. Maybe as soon as he mash it on me, I'm going to mash it on you. I can stand every bit of it, you know it. Damn right. And he said he's going to buy me a diamond ring. Yeah, give me one. I know a guy down on Main Street. Take every one I can get. <laughs> and he's going to buy me a mink stone. Yeah, give me one three-quarter length. My knee's been cold yet lately. <laughs> Baby, he say he gonna wrap me up in money, and he say he gonna buy me a Cadillac, baby, so long, it take it 30 minutes to turn the corner. <laughs> give, one, give me two, give me two, one for each foot. <laughs> How we gonna spend that old son bitch's money? I don't give a damn. Honey, I've been intending to dress you up. Dress me up? Yeah. Again? Yeah. Honey, I, you don't have to wear these old rags. What rags? These rags you ain't. Come on, baby, don't pull my clothes like that now. Come on. <laughs> Like he gonna buy mine. Yeah, but I got to stay sharp when you get back here. Now you know that, don't you? <laughs> Baby, I'm gonna sharp you, honey. Go ahead, yeah, on the top of Baby, don't do that. I don't told you. I got to stay sharp when you get you. I told you that in the first place. Baby, don't worry about the mule being blind. Uh -huh. Just load the wagon and pull the lane. How much? Go ahead, talk. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got everything under control, baby. You know what happened? Anything, yeah. yeah I cracked the whip and he make the trip. Yeah, I can understand it, dear. I sure can understand yeah, it. Yeah, baby. Here you go. What's that? Amen. What's that? What's that at the door? Oh, the neighbor. The neighbor? That's all I do. That's my little Ernestine. Daddy's back, like, woman. Daddy, that's your old man. Where can I go? Where can I go? Where can I go? In the bedroom. In the bedroom. Yeah. All right. Who open the door? Open this door before I break it down, woman. Let me break this damn door down. Yeah. Woman, yeah. what the hell is wrong with you? You hear me out there knocking, girl? You. you make me browse my damn shoulders up knocking. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was the wind. Woman, you know damn well the wind don't blow that damn hole. Baby, I didn't know. What was you doing in this house, woman? Nothing. You got a man in this house, woman? No, Daddy. You thought I was gone, didn't you? No. Yes, you did. You thought I was gone. No, you lying, woman. You lying. I see it lying inside your eyeballs, woman. <laughs> No, you thought I was gone. I would have been gone. I went down there in the plane, missed the cab, and made me late. Do you understand that, girl? Yeah, Dad, I was taking a bath. You what? I was taking a bath. How in the hell is you going to bath in the water been cut off for two months? <laughs> you got somebody in this house, woman. Baby, now look at my knee, baby. Mama, I you got my somebody knee. in this damn house. Look, I hurt my knee. Mama, keep See? your dress down so I can stay mad, damn it. <laughs> So sick. Damn your back, woman. You got anybody in this house, girl? Baby, no. Tell you must have somebody. There ain't nobody here. Well, what you running for if you ain't got nobody here? I ain't running. I'm scared. Close as this room is, you running, woman. Yes, ain't nobody here. Somebody must be here. You didn't want me in here, woman. Yes, I did. I thought you was rubbing eat more. You thought I was who? Rubbing eat more. Woman, you know damn well I ain't eating no more. You know that. <laughs> You know damn well you are. Well, it wasn't no vibrator. I don't give a damn what it was, woman. You ain't gonna change my conversation. You got a man in this house. Ain't no man in here. Woman, if you got a man in y'all, find it my damn self. You understand? Well, you look for him, you bug-eyed, jealous fool. You can say what you want, but I'm gonna find that. Well, find you, man. I am gonna find you. You miserable old bastard. Well, I mean, oh. say what you want, girl. Oh, don't get in that bed and stay till I get there. I ain't staying nowhere. Well, you can jump out, fall out, and kill yourself. I'm gonna whoop you in that damn way. Oh, me up tonight. I don't give a damn what you say, man. I mean that. Must be a man in your some damn way. I ain't lying. No, he ain't there. Must be lying in your some damn way. No, he ain't there. Where in the hell can he be at? I looked over there and he wasn't there. I looked all out there and he wasn't there. And this sucker here with this damn knife, I know he ain't there. <laughs>